following breaking news closer to home here fire on the water crews are racing to put out flames that broke out on a massive yacht let's get right to local 10's louis aguirre live on watson island with this one louis and uh, nicole and calvin that yacht's still hot marcus i want to have you push in to the scene right now these are live pictures of that yacht still on fire you can see the smoke just billowing from that vessel as the city of miami fire rescue fireboat continues to just pour water as that boat is almost all the way in the water the fire sparking just before 7 30 tonight and a massive response from both city of miami and miami-dade county as they try to contain that those flames from spreading and causing even more damage oh wow big flames engulfing a big boat at island gardens marina on watson island wednesday night complete shock yeah. But, like, my concern was obviously the safety of, you know, everyone around here. The 120-foot on Diamo and Inferno on Biscayne Bay as firefighters race to stop the flames from spreading to nearby luxury vessels. We also focused on trying to get some of the uh, neighboring yachts that weren't close to it out of the way so that they didn't receive any damage. As you can see right now, this is still a very ongoing operation. More than 45 firefighters from the city of Miami and Miami-Dade County on the scene. The enormous vessel beginning to list and sink within the hour. Do you know if anybody was on the yacht when it caught fire? As far as uh, what was taking place on the yacht, we still don't know yet. The damage catastrophic. The yacht a total loss. Back out live, you can see that firefight continues at this hour, almost four hours after this thing sparked. The good news is no injuries reported just yet. The investigation continues the cause way too early to determine. But I guess the bigger question right now is who that yacht belongs to. We're hearing a lot of sources here on the marina telling us that that yacht belongs to singing superstar Mark Anthony. And if that is indeed the case, the person that sold Mark Anthony that yacht, South Florida developer, George Perez. That's the very latest from Watson Island. Louis Aguirre, Local 10 News.